<laughs> what's up world i'm darren lamar there's a dead bird on the side of me that's right we're gonna be smoking some <laughs> chicken out on the pit boss tailgater so let's get this rub on here and let's get it going um brine that i put together is just salt thyme garlic powder and a whole bunch of stuff you can use whatever you want in a brine really get nice and juicy so it's been sitting in this for about six hours you could go overnight but we're not, so let's get started on this rub. We're gonna be using a basil oil from Costco. You can use olive oil or any type of binder that you want for your chicken. Just gonna sprinkle that on here. I'm gonna go. I usually like to start with the lighter color season first. Just so, just so I know uh just so I could see, like, for reference. Okay. Put some curry powder on. Curry powder on here. Just light with some curry powder. Kind of for color. Give it some flavor, too. Um, some pepper. This is pretty good. Yeah, I've been using this on everything lately. This is the, uh, everything but the bagel season. I don't know if you can see that. But it's good, so we're gonna sprinkle some of that. Got some sesame seeds in here. So I did add some chipotle chili pepper and some Jamaican jerk rub. So that's the violet salt I'm using. So the chicken is nice and seasoned up. We're gonna let this sit for about five minutes before we put it on the grill. So we had the pit boss uh, tailgater out there. Preheating for about 25 minutes at 325 degrees, 350. Back down to smoke. I'm gonna smoke this chicken for about 45 minutes. I'm gonna crank up the heat, probably about 350 for the rest of the cook till it reaches temp. I'm gonna smoke this for about 45 minutes. So we got that good smoke going on right now. It is at 380 because uh, the pellets just dropped it into it. So oh, it's climbing up a little higher. Oh, it's getting pushed through the auger. I'm gonna come in after this smoke session. Uh, I will show you guys the internal temp on the chicken. And now that I say, if you look in and cook in I just wanna show you guys where we're at. Cover. Chicken is all done. We are gonna cut straight into this and see how it turned out. Recap before we do that. Initially put it on, I had it on smoke uh, for about 55 minutes uh, just to get that flavor going, that smoke flavor. I was using Traeger Gourmet Blend pellets, but this is the bird, let's see how it looks. You're nice and golden, has a nice crust on it. that it's dry because uh, look at those juices coming out of there. Didn't do anything special with like the legs or tie it up or anything like that. The skin is uh, nice and crispy. I actually like the skin on my meat so. Looking like Thanksgiving up in here. And it's super juicy. All right, so that bird is amazing. I'll give you guys a bite. Did you guys get that good meat in there? My cat is over there looking plastic. Mm. That scam. And on this, it's amazing. That rub that I put together. That trigger pellets. Wow. I mean, you could just see the juices. You can just see the juices in here. Mm. I wish you could smell this and taste this too. Let me just take another bite for you guys. I mean, I think what really did it, I didn't have to use a lot of salt on this because I brined it for about six hours. I put about, I put a good, good amount of salt. All right, that's amazing. Got some real California gold, baby. If you guys enjoyed this uh, video, Make sure you give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment. Let me know what you guys want to see me cook. We also try to grill something on the Traeger 
comment below let me know uh, make sure you hit the subscribe button and uh, I will see you guys on the next video let's eat some more of this chicken for y'all one more bite to get the meat on that wing that is some juicy 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 meat right there mm. free level smoker the pit boss hands down for the value I'm not sure the longevity of it but for the value straight off the line you're getting your money's worth and then some you guys hit that like button enjoy this California goat I'll see you guys on the next one